Typically, a passive volume pedal electrically consists of two jacks and a pot, wired as so. Selecting the right pot is important. In this case, 600 kilo. Now it can be anywhere between 500k and 1 mega ohm. You can also use a pole pot as well, but they'll be suffering in the signal quality and expression. This leaves us with the mechanical side. In many designs, the treadle is connected to a string wound onto a spring-loaded spindle attached to the pot. However, I wanted to try something different. At first, I was considering driving the pot directly from the treadle, but this idea was quickly scrapped as the treadle simply did not have the range of motion required to turn the pot enough to have the desired change in volume. So I opted for a wheel instead. Now, if you noticed in the introduction clip, there was a bit of motion required to turn it, but this can be resolved by using a smaller wheel, and I highly recommend you do so if you want to use this design. As you can see, I've cut the wheel down in size. Now it will take less movement from my foot to turn the wheel, and therefore the pot the desired amount. I would call this one a success. Okay, there are no entries in this week for Q&A. Feel free to leave any questions you have about my projects and I. Big shout out to Thabo Meerkat. Those of you in the fandom should definitely stop by his channel and check it out. Also, I'll start releasing videos on Wednesdays if possible, so if you haven't already, definitely subscribe and hit the bell so you don't miss it. Until then, thanks for watching.